Wow. We just had some drama. I was just finishing up that last video and watching another one decide what I wanted to try and my mom comes in, they gotta call an ambulance. My mom's friends have been here, they came over last night and they um they stayed the night and this morning he fixed help well, he checked out our boiler, we gotta get it fixed because don't worry, we don't have any hot water. But um afterwards he um his history of heart problems, he had a quadruple bypass and stuff and we I don't know if he had a heart attack or something happened, but he was fading in and out, and um, we had to call the ambulance for him and everything. I took a little bit of video of him, but it's all messed up, and, and I probably won't put it on here. But, um, took some pictures of the fire truck outside. Um, I'm out of breath. My heart's kind of pumping, so, wow. Um, I know I had other vlog stuff to say here. Maybe I ought to say it while I'm right here. Before my battery dies out again, I think my camera battery's about had it. Um, does anybody else take notes on what they're going to say in their videos? Y'all know I can't remember too good, so <laughs> I take notes. Um, let's see. In case y'all haven't noticed, I fidget. I'm a mean fidgeter. I'm always me touching my hair. I'm itching to itch and move my glasses. Sorry about that. It must drive people crazy. Um, I can't read that. Oh, for those people who saw what I looked like before this, which would probably be people on, like, TEF and stuff, um, or any family that have to check this out, um, you probably tell from the way I talk, but I look like I have space teeth, which I naturally did after I let my uh, teeth go after my braces came up, I rebelled, but they were also broken. I had this tooth on the side here, it was broken almost in half. And these two front teeth were hardly there at all anymore, but I had them fixed, I had them bonded. And so, a lot of stains and stuff, and I still need to be cleaned up and fixed some more. But, I can smile without being able to see through my tonsils, tonsils you know? So, I made a big cheesy smile to show off my teeth. Kind of fixed in um, March, I think. Um, what else? Um, oh, in case anybody wants to see me without my glasses, I still got glass face here with the imprints, but. That's me without my glasses on. Do I look better with or without my glasses? I think I look better with them because <laughs> you can't really see my face so much. But there I am. I'm back. I have really long eyelashes, so I have a hard time getting the glasses where they're supposed to go without my, my eyelashes rubbing against them. Um, what else did I have to say? I have a lot of different things to mention, but... Um, I am happy that I've been getting out a little more lately, even if it's just to the yard, just to go in the pool or sit in the swing. And I've been taking pictures of the garden almost every day, every other day, to track the progress of my lilies. And so this is very good for me because sometimes it'll be over a month before I even go out in the yard. So it's a very big deal. Um, to those who don't know, I am from Boston. I have a weird hybrid accent though. I used to be real bad, you know, Pocky Khan, Havid Yad, and a lot of words you still hear me in, like, airport. We don't go to the airport. We go to the airport. And so, yeah. And so, um, my accent is a little mishmash because I, I used to spend a lot of time, well, I still do spend a lot of time in Tennessee, but it used to just be like a month out of the year, and I, or two, depending on my visits. And then I lived down there for six months before I filled miserably at that independence thing and came home. Um, but, so I picked up even more of the accent. So I do say yard, an orange, instead of orange. And uh, I think I say fork now, thinking about it. See, that utensil up this part of the country is a word dirt, you know, because it's a fox, you know? So that can be misconstrued as something else. <laughs> So, yeah, my accent is a mishmash, and you can definitely tell, I think, when you listen to it. Um, you never know where I'm from, but I am from Boston. I'm proud of it. I love Boston. Well, I live in Revere, which is not my favorite place. I grew up in Lynn, 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 City of Sin. Never come back the way you went in, but it was much better when I lived there. Now it's kind of gone to pot. And Revere, I've always hated. Yep. Always hated. But Boston in general, I love. I love going into town. Well, I did. Now I just can't get on that stinking train. Oh! I can't go underground. Just thought of it freaks me out. And I have so many phobias, you know? Claustrophobia, climacophobia. I'm afraid I'm going to fall on the stairs. So 
so I have to take a deep breath before I walk down the stairs. And sometimes I do fall down the stairs or almost fall. So I have I do have a lot of phobias. Fear of suffocating, probably from one too many asthma attacks and hyperventilation fits. Um, I have panic attacks, I have um, major depressive disorder, um, obsessive compulsive disorder, a touch of post traumatic stress disorder, so I'm dealing better with that. Um, generalized anxiety disorder, uh, social anxiety problems. I am um I'm a freak. Yeah. But uh I had a nervous breakdown a couple of years ago. I just kinda complete total emotional meltdown. But I'm working back from it still, but it's a start. So I guess I'll probably cut short that now I gotta charge up the battery more. I think I need to buy a new battery. <laughs> With what money? But it's Pretty much that one, I don't know, it doesn't hold the charge long. I know I've been taking a lot of pictures lately, but it seems like I need to charge it after almost every time I use it, which, that's not good. I hope they aren't too expensive. I'll have to look it up. I'll eBay it. So, that's it for now. Probably put up a couple of different responses in a little bit, and I have a question that I want to ask if anyone wants to respond, so, probably not. <laughs> okay, bye. And yes, I do say bye in all my videos. I don't know if that's normal or not, but it's like I'm talking to you, and if I'm just going to leave, I gotta say bye. I just can't take off, you know? Okay.